Hey everybody, it's D9 here with CameraSharp.com. As always, a huge shout out to Rock Canyon Studios. Today I'm going to teach you how to change the icons on your tracks. Now this is something that may seem really simple, but it's actually something that's really important. It will be able to help you distinguish between your different tracks. Okay, so it's super easy, super simple here. What you're going to do is come over to your track, bring this down, grab the icon, simply choose through all these different icons that we have. There's a lot of really cool ones here in Logic Pro. Got all these different ones to choose from, different different mixing boards, different different mics. They really took their time making some really cool icons here on the Logic Pro 10. All right, well that's pretty much it. That's how you go ahead and change those icons. There's a bunch of different icons here that are really cool. You've got uh, even got German Shepherd over there. You got some explosions. We even got you know a little metronome. Got all the strings that we need. The percussion, the bass. You got the bass amp. It's really cool. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little quick tutorial about all of the different options that you have for icons.